Hello guys, I am Ravi Paliwal and welcome to the Wireshark Labs. So in this lab we are going to cover the net. So what is net? Net is network address translation and it is a method used to modify network address information in the packet headers while they are transiting. Okay, so how net works? So uh, you know that internet is collection of various local networks among the uh, uh, in, across the world. So uh, you know that in local uh, area network we have our uh, public uh, sorry private IP addresses okay so we don't want to share that private IP addresses uh, with the network so that uh, our information can be secured okay so uh, to implement this security and confidentiality mechanism internet uh, uses net protocol so net is uh, what is net doing that it is assigning a uh, single uh, public IP address to a local network and all the devices in that local network assigned a unique port so that it can identify again whenever needed okay so uh, net have a translation table and a port address uh, tra translation that is that are different ports assigned to the network so there are various types of net uh, there, uh, there is static net uh, dynamic net and uh, net overload or pad, that is also called uh, called pet and uh, you can take a screenshot uh, from here uh, for the reading okay so uh, we can uh, start with uh, uh, the lab and we'll go to the manual so you can see that there is a home network that is local network and there is a uh, net router that translates uh, uh, the addresses and uh, there is a isp network there which providing us internet services okay so uh, i have simplified this manual in this word file okay so this word word file i have simplified uh, so you can see that we are provided with net home site and net uh, isp site trace files so you know that we cannot get the ISP side trace uh, uh, live okay so we are using trace file in this labs uh, okay so uh, we have net home side uh, trace file so let us open Wireshark and uh, we have to open home side trace file so I have already opened uh, net home side okay and you have to uh, add a column of time here okay also so how you can add a column you will right click here and you will uh, click on column preferences and uh, you will click on this plus icon then you write the name here and select here time format as specified so i have already created this column so i will not be creating again so we have to find the source ip address and destination ip addresses uh, at uh, provided time that provided time is 7109267 and the google's ip address and uh, destination is google's ip address that is provided here okay so we will be finding this ip address and the source ip address so first we filter it using http and ip address is this that is google's ip address so when we filter we'll find that the at this time we uh, made uh, this ip address made a get request okay and at this time uh, it got a response okay so you note this time and this ip address and from here you uh, note the port okay also also note the port okay so 4335 here, here the port number is and uh, the ip address so we have noted information here okay and you can also uh, see the ip information uh, here also that is header header length uh, and the ip address is there and nothing more information okay so uh, now we open the net uh, isp side file okay so in this isp side we will remove the filters okay and we will find the time at uh, we have made uh, get request okay 710 i think what was that time uh, we will find in the uh, manual that was 7109267
okay so we'll find that time so uh, i think that is the time okay so you know that in reaching the request to uh, to the isp side it may be some some uh, may be taking some time okay so this is the request time okay so that is 7109893 taken some time and uh, what is this uh, request saying that it is uh, address resolution uh, protocol that is uh, net okay and it is using uh, the hardware size and protocol size and opcode request there are some predefined code uh, and it is also saying that senders mac address that that information uh, is used for uh, trans uh, used for translation uh, net net table okay and you can see that senders ip address it is showing uh, that uh, showing uh, changed ip address there was some address like 192 and uh, okay so here you can see that uh, here it, it is changed ip address okay so let us again uh, see that at what time it has uh, sent a response uh, so that was 15 something uh, there okay 150875 and in the uh, net home site trace file will open again we see that uh, at what time we have seen the response there okay so seven uh, okay seven one five uh, I'll uh, first apply that filter again HTTP and IP is this so we got that response seven one five eight seven nine seven so it also has taken some time so we can see that here the uh, addresses uh, uh, was different and there the addresses was different so that was the main work of net uh, protocol okay and after an analyzing this information our task is to fill the net table that is showing the local ip addresses and uh, the internet ip addresses uh, which are shown to us uh, sorry we forgot to analyze the ports okay so here the port was uh, here yeah, the port was i think uh, i'll close this ip and i'll see the tcp source port was 4335 and destination was 80 and in that file uh, what was the port we'll analyze in in this file the port number uh, we are not getting that time so we remove the filters and we'll select that time that was 7 one zero nine eight uh, something yeah so here we can see that port information is maybe somewhere inside this information okay so we are not getting the port information here okay so you can see uh, you can definitely see that the port information will be changed uh, yes yeah, in this tcp okay in this tcp the port information is changed to 4337 and it is using a, a single uh, you can see that 71192341047119234104 a single ip address for the uh, whole local network okay and the port number is are the different in the different uh, requests okay so in this way net identifies uh, different devices on the uh, local network okay so thank you for being in the in this lecture and if you like my videos then please uh, share uh, with your friends okay thank you guys